All right, guys, so we are now on our way to Cave and Basin historic site. We've hiked from downtown Banff, which is somewhere in that direction. And we're heading to Cave and Basin, which is about a half a kilometer away from us, this direction. Dorothy's gone ahead of me there. And I'm gonna go catch up to her. And uh, we'll show you guys what's up at the historic site there. I think it's uh, $8 per person to get in. And let's see if we can get in. It's about 2.39 2 p.m. now. And they close at six, so should be okay. I don't see a lot of people, so. We're currently visiting Banff in October, in the fall. The views are just amazing, guys. Crazy views. The mountains, Rocky Mountains, are absolutely outstanding. Alright guys, so we're just arriving at Cave and Basin. And we're about to head in. Got Dorothy across the street there. Let's see what's up. We're at Cave and Basin, guys. Going in. cave now guys it's a bit dark in here so the GoPro might not show very well So we're just going up to the exterior pool and the smell of sulfur is very strong it kind of has a foul odor but apparently it has a lot of health benefits I see there's like a hole over there where the water is going through. Indeed, yeah. What is that? <laughs> so that's just an outtake. Okay. It, used to, it just feeds right underneath the building here. Okay. And that will go down into the marsh ecosystem. Okay. So, so was that man built? If you take a little walk down that way, you can go down on the boardwalk. Like you'll actually see a lot of that water flowing down there. It just oh, changes the ecosystem down there. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, my radio is really no, loud. Okay. Oh. That's so cool.
Alright guys, so these uh, panels here are basically just talking about the glaciers and the way they've um, changed over time. And this national park that we're in right now guys, the Banff National Park, is actually the first national park in Canada, which was commissioned by Canada's first Prime Minister. I believe his name was uh, Sir John A. Macdonald. So that's pretty interesting to know. All right, guys, so what we're going to do is we're pretty much finished with the Cave and Basin National Historic Site exhibit. And uh, the Parks Canada representative just told us that we could just basically head through this path here and it goes through the trees where there's a few more hot springs and then it'll lead back out on the other side to the parking lot where we came in so we'll probably just do that to finish off and uh head back to downtown bam but so far so good guys having an amazing time here in alberta i never imagined that canada would be this beautiful because we've been kind of stuck in ontario All right guys, so that's where we're coming from. Haven Basin Hot Springs and the view of the mountains in the distance. And we're heading to a, another hot spring actually that we were told is up here. And Dorothy is yelling at me to come and catch up, so I'm gonna do just that. And here's another one here, guys. Thermal spring. I can see actually little tadpoles or little baby fishes in there. You see them? Where? Oh, yeah. And here it is running out of the rock. Crazy. You can literally see it coming from under here and obviously out there. So guys, I followed the spring to the source and this is like basically a dead end and this is where the, the spring starts. It comes out of the rock right here and then it flows all the way down. Still gives off that sulfur smell, hydrogen sulfide. So it kind of has a foul smell, and yeah, pretty interesting. All right, let's head down. All right guys, so thanks for hanging out with us and we're headed to our next destination and that will be the Banff Springs Fairmont Hotel and we'll see you in that one. Take care guys. <laughs>